Hey, yo, what's up, everybody? This is Josh here. How you guys doing? Welcome to the Daily Talk. I almost feel like I gotta call this the Weekly Talk because I haven't seen you guys in, in a while. Hope you guys got something good. We're going right in. Alright, going right into this daily talk. The confusion around CBD is not going to clear up anytime soon. The Department of Health here in the state of Hawaii is still going to put their stance on CBD as a prescription drug since the federal government is issuing a FDA approved um, prescription drug. Uh, I believe it's called Epilo Epilox or I need to go look that up I will look that up but there is a prescription FDA approved uh, pharmaceutical drug that has CBD in it which makes this CBD become a pharmaceutical product now requiring a prescription so the laws the regulations are really confusing and really gray on this issue so we're definitely going to stay tuned but on the on the flip side of this thing i was talking with a cbd um representative somebody in the industry somebody that works with a cbd a major cbd company in, uh, in the country and he said on the federal level the fact that the 2018 farm bill legalized the production of hemp on the federal level he believes that indicates that CBD and hemp will become legal on the federal level uh, he does recognize, he did tell me that there are laws within other divisions of the government that are kind of contradicting each other right now. So they are currently working with the legislation to pull that through and to clear that up. In fact, last week, Friday, there was an emergency session held to discuss the, the 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 Department of Health ruling because of the FDA ruling that uh, CBD uh, edible products containing CBD is now an adulterated food, making it illegal under that Food and Drug Administration Act. Uh, so because of the fact that these laws and rules are starting to contradict it itself. There's been an emergency session. This emergency session hopefully has cleared it up. I have yet to hear anything that has come out of this session, but we'll surely update you guys as soon as I find out. In other news, I would like to give you guys an update on the Koi Cannabis and Hemp Expo. We are still scheduled for September 21st at the Hilton Garden Inn. I really hope to see you guys there. We are opening up vendor applications and sponsor applications. We've sent out a bunch to you. If you haven't received a vendor application and you would like to receive one, please contact us at events at gmail.com or at any one of our social media sites on Instagram or face Facebook or you could leave a comment here at this YouTube video or leave a comment anywhere on our Facebook pages or anywhere on our social media saying you would like an application you would like a link and if you know somebody that should be there put a tag in the comments below 
and we'll try and get them there. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I will try to be better at fuck that. I will be better at putting more daily talks out there, and I'll see you next time.